Yeah, I think it's it's really interesting. We'll 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 jump into the the skills in in a moment, but it it is one of the most interesting roles if you if you have the um, if you have the ability to withstand some of the pressure, particularly in the the banks. Mm-hmm. It's one of the best roles to to develop your your leadership skills and your interpersonal mm-hmm. your interpersonal skills. As, as well as I think there's no other role that gives you as much exposure to all areas of the, the operation, mm-hmm. um, which is often, I think, why you see very good major instant managers tend to go on and, and have very good careers. If they stay in major instant management, it's often you see them go into the, the better paying roles, which, again, are often in the banks. The salaries are mm-hmm. higher because they, they right. require the experience, and and mm-hmm. which is obviously desirable. But I think also... Um, there's very few roles which bring quite as much excitement and also a sense of accomplishment. Mm-hmm. I think it's quite special when, when it's a while ago mm-hmm. now, but when I was um, mm-hmm. doing operational major instant management, no matter how hard the, those mm-hmm. days or nights were, if it ran over, um, mm-hmm. I think they were some of the most fulfilling of my career in the sense of camaraderie with the technical mm-hmm. teams and the wider operational team the sense that you're actually mm-hmm. doing really good work and also how, how exciting and fast paced it can be. I think it's really quite a special role, but it's also, mm-hmm. I think why you see people who have a natural talent for it tend to go on into senior leadership positions, mm-hmm. their careers mm-hmm. tend to do very well. I think the combination mm-hmm. of exposure you get and, and the people you meet mm-hmm. and the visibility from the leadership team, they're seeing all the comms mm-hmm. you issue. You're potentially having one-on-one mm-hmm. conversations. They get a real, um, sense of, of your capabilities um mm-hmm. coupled with, with the, the skills you get to practice and work on there's very few other jobs i think where you get so much experience mm-hmm. in leading under such um pressure and so i think everything after that mm-hmm. within your career tends to be fairly easy yeah. compared to perhaps some of your, your more challenging days as a uh, mm-hmm. as a major incident manager i think you also get to um you get to fail a lot and improve really, really quickly. I that's, think in normal, right. yeah, in normal leadership roles, you get to um, these scenarios or difficult scenarios might come up once a month, mm. maybe once a week if, if you've got a challenge. Whereas major incident management, you might be dealing with two or three of these a day. 